Hey everyone. Today we're talking about something big happening with Ford and other car companies. Sales are down, and it's not just about Ford, it affects all of us. Ford's cutting prices on their trucks and electric cars like crazy. Sounds good, right? Well, not so fast. They're doing this because people stopped buying their cars. Remember when they added all those fancy features and raised prices? That didn't work out so well. Now there are tons of new Fords just sitting around, especially F-150 trucks. It's like a car graveyard. Ford says they're doing a quality tests, eh but that's fishy. They've had a lot of recalls lately. Hey, if you're enjoying this video so far, hit that subscribe button. It really helps the channel. Now, get this, Ford's actually selling more cars than ever, but they're losing market share. How? It's because of something called a stair steps. Basically, dealerships get rewards for selling more trucks. Some dealers are so focused on hitting sales targets that they don't care about making customers happy. But here's the kicker, Ford's losing a ton of money on electric cars. We're talking $36,000 per car. Why keep doing it? It's all about the fancy computer stuff in new cars. These high-tech cars are causing problems for local mechanics. They can't fix them without special tools and info from the car companies. This means we have to go back to the dealership for everything, which costs us more money. Insurance companies are having a hard time too. When electric cars get in accidents, they often just write them off as totaled because they're so expensive to fix. This is a big problem for car owners. So what's going on here? Are cars getting too smart for their own good? Maybe. There's a big fight happening about the right to repair a laws. These laws would make it easier for regular mechanics to fix new cars. And don't forget about all the data these smart cars collect. They know where you go, how you drive, and maybe even what you say in the car. That's kind of creepy, right? It's not just Ford dealing with this stuff. Tesla and other companies are cutting prices too. They're all trying to sell more cars, but it's causing a big mess. What do you think about all this? Are cars getting too complicated? Should we be worried about our privacy? Let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.